After moving into our new home a few months ago, the first thing we wanted to do was change out the old flooring to make the space feel lighter and brighter. We started by clearing out the room and removing the existing floor. This floor had seen better days, so we decided to remove everything down to the concrete slab. Luckily, we were able to keep the existing baseboards, but the quarter round had to go as well. Once the flooring was gone, we rolled up the old underlayment and replaced it with a 6 mil poly. This is a must when installing LVP over a concrete slab to help keep out the moisture. We are using Malibu Wide Planks Click and Lock Waterproof Luxury Vinyl Plank Flooring in the color French Oak Berkeley. We started in the left corner of our living room and attached spacers to the wall to keep our first row from sliding under the baseboards. We decided to start our first row with half of a plank. You can easily cut these planks by marking a line with a square, scoring the plank with a utility knife, and snapping it in half. The first planks are installed with the groove side sticking out so we could install the new rows into the groove and click them into place. If the plank doesn't lay perfectly flat, you can easily unclick it, reinstall the plank until you hear it properly click together. After that, we figured out that nothing in our home was square since this is an older house. So we grabbed a laser level, set it up, and followed that line to ensure that our first row was laid as straight as possible. When it comes to the end of the row, it is time to make a cut. Then, with your leftover piece, you can begin your new row so long as there is a 7 inch variation between the seams. Doing this, you'll ensure that your seam pattern is staggered since you don't want two seams right next to each other. You don't need to be strong to install this flooring. The pieces slide into place easily, and actually, if you're too rough on the seams, you could break them. We did use a mallet in some areas to make sure that they were totally clicked in, but only on the short side, never the long side. Installing this was perfect for beginner DIYers because of the easy installation, and once you lay the first few rows and get into a groove, you can keep moving until all of a sudden the whole room is done. We brought our flooring from the living room into the kitchen, entryway, and dining room. We were nervous to have the two rooms meet again, but the planks perfectly matched up, clicked together, and flowed through the whole house. There were a few more difficult cuts to make, and for this, we utilized a skill saw for the cuts around the stairs and in some of the entryways. Once the final piece was laid, we could not believe the transformation. It honestly feels like a different house. It's brighter, feels bigger, and so luxurious. The semi-gloss finish gives just enough shine, the floor never feels flat. And actually, it looks like real wood floor. Not to mention it's waterproof, scratch resistant, and easy to clean and mop, and as dog owners, this is important to us. We truly couldn't be happier with our new flooring. I hope this inspired you to take a second look at your old floor. Thanks to Malibu Y Plank for sponsoring this video.